Good evening, and welcome to another episode of Basically, It's Biblical. In honor of this season of Thanksgiving, I would like to read a few scriptures to help us to focus on where our minds should be, where we ought to be thinking and giving glory and honor to God alone, for he is the provider. He is the author and finisher of our faith. He alone is King of kings and Lord of lords, and all honor is due to him alone. For everything we have and everything that we do not have, we ought to give thanks unto the Lord, for he has all the wisdom and knowledge. He knows what we ought to be given and what ought to be kept. He knows how to provide for us. He knows how to keep us. He's provided angels to protect us and guard us and give us warning and wisdom. He has provided for all of our needs and even some of our wants. So let us give thanks. And you already have the scriptures for tomorrow's Bible study beginning Saturday at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we will continue our study of the Holy Spirit and how the Holy Spirit is given to us also as a gift from our Lord and Savior. Understanding the purpose and methods of the Holy Spirit will help us to go forward and understand the book of Revelation, the book of Daniel, and the other texts, uh, Ezekiel 37, 38, 39, um, with regards to the end of days or the end times or Jacob's troubles, the day of Jacob's troubles, or this time that we are in and experiencing all of that we're experiencing, we still ought to give thanks to the Lord. Leviticus 22 and 29. And when ye will offer a sacrifice of thanksgiving unto the Lord, offer it at your own will. Psalm 95 and 2. Let us come before his presence with thanksgiving and make a joyful noise unto him with psalms. Psalm 116 and 17. I will offer to thee the sacrifice of thanksgiving and I will call upon the name of the Lord. Ecclesiasticus 51 and 11. I will praise the na- thy name continually and will sing praise with thanksgiving. So my prayer was heard. It's important to understand there that when we give thanksgiving and when we sing praises with thanksgiving to the Lord, it enables our prayers to be heard. Ecclesiasticus 51 and 11. 1 Timothy 4 and 4. For every creature of God is good, and nothing to be refused if it be received with thanksgiving. Jonah 2 and 9. But I will sacrifice unto thee with the voice of thanksgiving. I will pay that I have vowed. Salvation is of the Lord. <clears throat> second, uh, second, uh, second Corinthians 9 and 12. For the administration of this service not only supplieth the wants of the saints, but is abundant also 
by many thanksgivings unto God. And Revelation 7 and 12 saying amen blessing and glory and wisdom and thanksgiving and honor and power and might be unto our god for ever and ever amen and amen and until tomorrow be blessed and give thanks <music>